Ever since I was younger, I was into video games. Somebody like the fuse who I can bring bad news to all these crews who can't NBA jam with the shoe. Hey everybody, welcome back to another beer review, another blind battle beers. Why are we doing this? Um, I have gotten a weird amount of comments recently on some older blind battle beer reviews, specifically that have Miller High Life in them, saying that I'm not being fair to Miller High Life because when I do um, battle beers, I always use cans. And there have been like five or six comments in the last couple of weeks saying, Miller High Life's way better out of the bottle. You're not giving it a fair shot. So I'm like, I, I don't, <laughs> I don't know if that's the case. I can't imagine there's that big of a difference. So I decided on my way home from work today, it's like, you know what? I'm gonna get a bottle of Miller High Life and I'm gonna get a can of Miller High Life and I'm going to have someone pour them for me and I'm not gonna know which is which. And I'm gonna see if there's a difference. I am going to just right now say, I don't think I'm gonna be able to tell a difference between the two of them. Um, I don't think that there's that big of a difference in general with beer out of a bottle um, versus a can. I mean, if you look at all the amazing like craft beer that we drink, it's all in cans these days. They went away from bombers and the beer is still great. So um, it's just strange how many people recently have been saying that Miller High Life is better out of a bottle than it is out of a can. So we're doing it. <laughs> I just, I have to finally like put this to bed. I like, it's weird. I don't know why all of a sudden, like all these comments are happening. I don't know if like some of the videos got shared somewhere. I have no idea. Um, but every, almost every ba uh, blind battle beer that I've posted over the last year and a half that has Miller High Life in it, there's been a comment recently saying, that's not fair, High Life's better out of the bottle. So that's what we're doing. I don't know which one's which. Um, they look the exact same. This one has much more carb. Same amount of head though. Tons and tons of bubbles in this one. Not so much in this one. So, I mean, we don't need to like smell one and taste one. We can just do this kind of side by side. I don't want it, this doesn't have to be a long video. Smells like Miller High Life. Also smells like Miller High Life. Maybe a little sweeter. Oh, there's not one of these that you're like, oh, this smells so much better. They're both sweet, corny, bready. Smell like beer. Smell like American macro lager. Let's try the uh, black glassy glass first. Cheers. It tastes sweet. It's crisp. It's dry. Super easy drinking. Tastes like Miller High Life. Tastes like beer. A little bit of a grassy note to it. Not offensive. No hops just sweetness and white bread crust. Well, yeah, let's try the orange one. Cheers. Okay. So this one is definitely sweeter. Why is that? No idea. This one, I mean, there's plenty of bubbles in this glass. There's lots of bubbles in this one. This one's more prickly, feels lighter on your palate, um, but doesn't have the same amount of sweetness as this one. This one's... It doesn't smell that much sweeter. but it's sweeter on your palate. I mean, that sweetness maybe is giving it like an extra depth of flavor. Yeah, the grassiness is a little bit more present in this one. Is there a massive difference? No, but there is a difference. Do I know which one is which? No, <laughs> I have no idea. Um, the only thing I would guess is that this one is a can because there's more bubbles in the glass. Um, 
And if that's the case, there's just a little bit less sweetness in the canned version for whatever reason. I wonder if it's an age thing. I think this one has more of like that grassy, the grassiness. This one doesn't, it has just that corn sweetness. So, I mean, is there, is this something to where I'm like, holy shit, mind blown. One of these is crazy different. No, but they do taste different. It's minute, but they're, they're different for sure. <laughs> I'm just going to guess because of the carbonation. Um, if this is the case, do I think this beer is way better than this one? No. Um, do I have to seek out six packs of bottles when I'm doing blind battle reviews? Um, when I'm doing Miller High Life versus other American macro loggers? No. I'm just not going to worry about it because it's not that big of a difference. So, <clears throat> either way, Miller High Life is a great beer. I enjoy it. Let's see if we were right. It doesn't even matter for right. Can is black, bottle is orange. <laughs> we were wrong. So I think can bottle orange, can black. Bottle orange, can black. You know what's crazy is now that I'm looking at this, this being more still in the glass, if you look at this bottle, there's not a single bubble you can see which makes you think it's that. So now that we know this is a bottle of beer, since this one has more of that grassy characteristic, it gives it a little bit more of like a beer taste and I always joke around it smells like beer tastes like beer this has more of a beer flavor than this one this one obviously tastes like beer but it's much not much sweeter it's sweeter so do I think this is vastly superior to this no um and I'm not going to worry about buying six packs of bottles when I do <laughs> blind stuff moving forward with Miller High Life both of these are great I will gladly finish both of these um what is that 56 ounces of beer it's like what almost five beers it's no big deal we'll finish that i mean no problem but i mean is it, is it that big of a difference is it unfair to cans of miller high life to do blind macro lager uh things no it's not unfair but um for those of you who like beer miller high life more out of the bottle i guess i can kind of see why just because it offers a little bit more of like that beer feel with the more like that i guess the grassiness is more of like a little bit of a hop character this beer is not hoppy um, but yeah, this one's much more, not, I keep saying much more. Stop fucking saying that. It's just sweeter. January 15, 24. So we're coming up on the old expiration date on that one. March 25th, 24. So this one's got two more months as far as the expiration goes. Maybe that's what it is. So we'll put this to bed. I don't think there's that big of a difference. So I'm not going to worry about getting bottles of Miller High Life when I do blind battle beers moving forward. But if that's your thing, keep doing it. I hate having to recycle bottles. I hate the space that they take up in my fridge. Cans are just so much easier, uh, much more portable, easier like when you're going places, camping, at the beach, anywhere. So um, cans are just, I'll just, <laughs> cans are how I'm going to drink beer moving forward. I don't just, I just don't want to have to worry about the glass and all that stuff. So if that's your thing, I'm not going to not mad at you keep doing it do whatever you got to do um but if we're being honest they're really not that different so should we finish the one in the bottle <laughs> comment below if you think there's a huge difference and if you've never done this before do it see what you think it's whatever so that's it i'm out of here appreciate you guys watching see you soon cheers thank you for coming behind the bar in the arcade all that shit <laughs> I was younger, I was into video games. Somebody like the fuse so I can bring bad news to all these crews who can't NBA jam with the shoe.